Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Cordon. We are back for some more Baldur's Gate 3. In the previous episode, we had left off trying to get into this house. Uh, there are two barricades, but apparently if I try to attack them, everybody will become... Well, not hostile, but they will not like what I'm doing. So I'm gonna try to just avoid this area for now, and maybe come back here later. And I did remember something that I wanted to do, but I keep on forgetting. Which is, I still have um, potentially a puzzle. Did this one? No. There's a lady uh, corpse that's missing a head in the sewers and I want to find it. Uh, what did you have again? Penitent looks at you silently. Ah, this guy traded something, right? Acknowledgement in his eyes. It's been some time since I picked up the game, so I forgot what this does. When you rage, he has money and stuffs. Oh, I want this. And I think that's basically it. Okay, this can go for the laser. Okay. Penitent blinks. And there is a pouch for the passage of penitence and tasteful boots. Okay, I mean, I can just... Is he blind? He's voiceless, but... He doesn't seem to have a line of sight. Oh, I read this. Okay, so... Money... Okay, well, uh... Okay, I wasn't expecting it to be here. Saturn's skull. This skull was not subject to decay, but stripped clean of flesh entirely. Only the faintest of scorch marks mar the outside gleaming bone. Or the otherwise gleaming bone. A sign of great care, or perhaps even reverence. Sure, I'll take... Oh, now he has a... Wait, what? Uh... No, 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 where are you going? Two steps at a time. Oh, I can't speak to... Is she just gonna run toward Cows, a body? The skull's teeth are starting to chatter. Are they? <laughs> what, can I use it? No. Okay. Um, let me see if I remember where this was. That's a cash. That's the greasy film's place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this might have been closer to another waypoint, if I remember correctly. Because I remember being here. Yeah, I think it's through here. Yeah, here were the methods. This is where we fought the, the sorcerer and whatnot. So yeah, her body is over there. I can eat a grape while I wait. Wait, who's speaking? What? Hmm. Okay. Oh, now it's sad and at peace. Oh! We lay the thankful ghost to rest by combining its skull and skeleton. Innate fortitude. Once per long rest, you can use a reaction to make an attack roll or saving throw with advantage. I mean... Really? That's all? Eh. Eh. I say. Okay. <clears throat> Let us go back out. Okay, so I I'm avoiding this gate for now. This is just a guy selling newspapers. And I was trying to get into Casador's palace. And I still want to do that. And I know it's a it's a quest for Asterion, but I don't really want to bother right now in picking up Asterion, leveling him up, giving him items and whatnot. So I'm just gonna go. And I'm gonna see how this quest plays out without Asterion in the party. We know there's nothing to do over there. Here we fought the ambush. No secret rooms here. 
refugees. Okay, and the entrance I had spotted was this one here. I wonder if we can break this. I don't think we can. God, there's just way too many people speaking at the same time in the city. It's distracting and annoying. What is under here? Nothing. Um, Central Watchtower. It's not counted as stealing if I go in. Okay. Will this lead to the... the wall? It does. Okay. Okay, so this actually... Whoa, chest. This takes us a bunch of places. We can jump onto the roofs, maybe? This is stealing, really? Nobody can see me. Okay. Keep in pace. We can carry on. And here we are. I hope this leads into Kazador's palace, otherwise I'm gonna be sad. Okay, it, it even says Zar Palace South Tower. Uh, I think I will have a, a short rest here. Even though my people have their things. Oh. Okay, well, let's see what we find and I'll decide. I still have some spells available anyway. Water. Weird. I don't know why they do that. <clears throat> why they put containers inside of containers and they don't have anything. Ooh. This is the palace of Kazador Zar. Great. Entry is forbidden. Leave now, citizen. We failed an inside check. Let's go for deception. I'm inspecting the security on your master's orders. I will use friends, sure. Nice. Of course. Whatever the master desires. Enter freely. And of your own will. I imagine all of these people are gonna be vampires. Just a humanoid, interesting. Mr. Rat, what do you say? Another guest. Yes, yes. More bones <laughs> to chew, more bodies to nibble. Wonderful. Time for a chat. Another one. You, you, you one of them? <laughs> the fangy ones? Um, I don't think so. Good. Don't like when they change. Get big, hairy, mean. What? Make sure you stay away. That sounds more like werewolves. Another visitor? Staying long? The others are. What others? Who are these visitors? Guests. Came for a party. Never left, though. Mm -hmm. Don't know what happened to them. Don't want to know. But I'm sure you're different. I'm sure you'll be fine. We will see, I suppose. Slim <clears throat> pickings up here, but safe. No one grabbing, no one biting. Where are people biting rats? In the guts of the mm. palace. Hungry mouths down there. I'm getting flashbacks of um, Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. Which is a really cool, cool game. It had a lot of problems when I played it. Um, okay. Mm, this is counted as stealing, though. 
Let us quick save and see what's up. What's up? Okay. A key. Uh, it just says key, wait. So many keys, Jesus Christ. Okay, it's just a key. Uh, Zar Palace Servant Etiquette. Memorize these rules and do not fail to follow them. Do your job silently, do not speak unless spoken to, the master likes it quiet. If you are not busy, find something to do and look busy, the master likes diligence. If you encounter the master, stand still and cast down your eyes with deference, the master likes to be respected. No whistling, Chamberlain Dufay. Okay. Not sure if anything matters from that. I wonder, since this door is no longer counted as stealing, if we are still counted as intruders, if we're over here. They did allow us entry, though. Okay, this is the door we found outside, uh, from down there. There's a pouch. Easy, man. Wonderful pouch. Uh, okay, I guess we're gonna find out what's up. Obviously, with the Stadion, there will likely be a lot more interactions in this area, but again, I'm not going to bother with that. Okay, so why are you still with the Sharon wounds? Okay. I also have to do a quest. I still haven't done it. Victoria's List. There are 17 paintings, but sometimes some of them are the same painting, except that later someti sometimes they are different again. There are 17 candelabra. Sometimes I light them, but the candles won't burn down. There are 17 chairs, which are almost too, always too many. Father says that if I go to the ballroom, I will be bitten 17 times by 17 rats. Okay. I imagine there's going to be like a safe, <coughs> and uh, the password is going to be 17. Harrowing painting, sinister painting. Who are you, Vardrola? The master is pure. Great. His palace must be pure. No stain, no smudge, mm. no taint. Pure. Good, great. Okay. Wilhelm. Another guest for the master's celebration. But you're so late, the doors are sealed. All is underway. I love celebrations, what's the occasion? Tonight the master completes his ritual of ascension. And, well, the specifics are a matter for those inside. If you wish to join us, you are too late. Hmm. The master has commanded the door stay shut until the ritual is complete. A deception. Excuse me, your master invited me personally. 18. Oh, ho, ho. Well, if the master insists you are to be there, then you must be there. Mm -hmm. But please forgive me, I cannot unseal the doors. The master's kennel keeper, Godi, and he is trusted to open them. Okay, where do I find them? If you must find him, he lurks in the kennels below. Now, please, I need to prepare. All must be perfect for the master when he ascends. Okay. There is so much to do. I think so that scene prepare. was down there. I'm guessing this is the door. Arcane lock, we cannot knock it. Uh, I'm gonna try and find... Yeah, Goldie's downstairs, we just spotted him. Soro Sororal dance. We shall see his true form. I could try and lockpick it, but I'm gonna try and go the, the right way. I'm curious about the kennels. Chamberlain, private. I don't have the key for it. Not the action. <clears throat> Come 
Come on, Lazel. <clears throat> you can do it. I have 30 thieves tools. This is not gonna be more stubborn than me. Maybe it will. <laughs> okay, go again. Thank you. Some places oh. a spell like that would get you arrested. Here it seems. What? It gets you killed. Guidance? Because I used guidance. Try and talk your way out of it. Persuasion. Uh Oh, maybe it's because I used the friends on him? Okay. Let's not use it then. They believe you. Okay. So Okay, he was over there, whatever. Two steps at a time. Blood. Something over there. Dufay's diary. A rosewood cast. Oh, Jesus. Crap me. Chamberlain Dufay. I got scared. Um. Diary of Antoine Dufay, Chamberlain of Casador's Palace. The final page of the diary reads, I know enough about what the master has in mind with his ritual that I refuse to be the stand-in for that missing Bratisterian. Even if Casador finds my body, the potion bone cloak sold me is promised to provide a convincing illusion of death, especially since I'll leave behind the look-alike potion of acid poison. My one regret is dear Luriana, but I simply cannot trust her with the secret of my one chance of escape. For some reason, this name sounds familiar. When the potion wears off, Casador will have ascended and will have no ne and will have need of my services, or he will be no more, and mastery of the palace will fall to me. <clears throat> okay, so this guy is not dead. Can I? Uh... I can't help him up. This better be good. Quarta sune. A wicker chest. Okay. Give me just one second, please. And I'm back. Um, I was considering trying to smack this guy and see if he says something. So, let's try and go for non-lethal. And just smack him once. Oh, I can't. Because... Okay. Because the even the game considers the guy to be dead. What am I needed? Right we are. I have five potions of speed. I'm assuming yeah, I forgot right to magic. I forgot to give my friends their the pride of the gate. Their potions of speed. Let me just do this before I forget again. Two and one. So we have two for Gale and one for Shadowheart. Okay. Sharp as ever. And we also had this room, Chamberlain's office. An elegant robe. The ballroom door. Chamberlain Dufay, the Koza Kuran dictionary we used to train new servants on how to operate the ballroom door has gone missing, and my signet ring alone won't do the job. Please have the servants sort this out, it shouldn't be my problem to solve. Go day. The note continues in different handwriting. Go day. The servants and I are thoroughly busy in preparing for the master celebration. Get your bones out of the kennel and search every chamber of the vampire spawn level and quickly find that book. Okay, so I imagine we need a ring and some kind of uh, password or something? A mysterious elixir and a provender ledger. A ledger listing and tracking inventory of goods in regular use at the Tsar Palace with categories for food and drink for servants and guests. Cleaning supplies including alchemical bloodstain remover from bone clothes, opaque heavy curtains, candles of different sizes in yellow tallow, and red and black wax. Leather straps with buckles, balms and oils, and regular deliveries of Baldur's Mouth broadsheets. Right. Queen of Kingpins, this is matter. Seems the Flaming Fist Mercenary Company has compiled a great deal of information on Nine Fingers and her crew known as the Guild. Some heavy name Tuskron guarding some entrance the Fist are intrigued by. In fact, a very detailed account on the Guild's muscle and, you note, 
A tide of derision from the fist. Evidently they don't find Tuzgrand and criminals like him too bright. Not the sharpest scalpel in the surgeon kit, but fine fingers of her they write in sullen, fearful tones. <clears throat> yeah, I, I bet that if I tried to kill her, she would just die. And it also feels to me like this should be a secret area. Because the minimap is cut like this, which is kind of strange. <laughs> Mega spoilers. Okay. Did I miss something here? Oh, what? Okay, is this bugged or is it just an illusion? Luriana Sauvage. Chamberlain's private room key. She is a werewolf. My darling Dufay. Despite all your promises that when we went to the afterlife we'd go together, you went without me. Or did you? I found your body and the empty bottle. I know you took a potion, but was it poison or something else? Here are two more identical bottles. I'm going to drink one of them and then I'll join you one way or another. I love you for eternity, Luriana. <coughs> that was not smart. Whatever killed this werewolf burned it up from the inside. Its throat hmm. and innards are more liquid than solid. Okay, so is this also an illusion? It is an illusion. Interesting. Very interesting. So we're gonna go down, try and find these kennels. And naturally, eventually. I wouldn't touch that door. I can feel the death magic from here. Um. A fight's gonna break out. I want to investigate this. Sinister seal. Dark energy envelops this door. Hmm. The woman's eyes are alert, verging on manic as she bustles about. Everything's gotta be right for the master. Everything's gotta be perfect. Mm hmm. Okay. It's gotta be clean. It's gotta be immaculate. Dormitory wing. Do we have here? Door to the kennel. Okay, but I really want to find out what's in here. <clears throat> Maybe it's gonna kill me. <laughs> Maybe it's not, but I'm curious. What's this now? Aquatic magic. I'm not feeling so great. Vitality drain. The dead girl sapping curse is draining your vitality. Oh, there is a... Okay. So, Victoria. This cursed energy drains vitality of anyone who dares get closer. But I would like to investigate the area, though. <clears throat> I have an idea, maybe. Okay. Oh, enough waiting. I crave blood. So, what if I do this? I'm this sorry, Lazel. I'm sorry. Okay. Victoria's note. Victoria, remember to read that ancient language book. You'll need to know some of the vocabulary to be able to move freely within the palace. Hmm. Interesting. Ah, oh, come on, man. The. Okay. I can pick it up. I still have the curse. Lost in thought. She's gonna take some damage, I would imagine. Eager for battle. Okay. Really? I can't go over there. Um what if I do something stupid? Like 
I can't send to camp. Uh, I'm so sad. Let's throw the child against the wall. <laughs> Whee! Oh. Oh, she's over there. Okay, so hopefully now I can just move over here. <clears throat> and I should be away from the Vitality Drain. Okay, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Don't, don't! Goddamn morons. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. It will happen. Okay. Maybe it was worth it. Helmet of Grit. When the wearer has 50% hit points or less, they have an additional bonus action. Damn. I don't like being on low HP, but this can be very powerful. Very cool. Delirious Journal. Private Diary. Before I was Deliria, vampire spawn slave to Casador Zar, I was Dr. Deliria, physician general to the Parliament of Baldur's Gate. Spawn or no, I'm still Dr. Deliria and I will not submit to this lowly status. The others say vampirism is a curse, but in my educated opinion, it's a disease, and therefore must be vulnerable to medical treatment. I believe a massive infusion of fresh, youthful blood may overwhelm the vampirism infection and enable my body to heal. There is one potential source of such blood here. Victoria, the as yet pure blooded daughter of Leon Onuf Onufrio. Leon was a sorcerer before he was a vampiric slave and has warned us not to prey upon Victoria as he has imbued her with a counter curse in the event of attack, made her a necrotic booby trap as it were. I think Leon is bluffing. I think you may have paid the price. Oh, oh the dictionary! Okay, give this one to Will. Made it ready. The book is a dictionary on the ancient Kozakuran language from the distant land of Karatur. Flipping through the pages, you find certain words and phrases underlined. Open, enter, beware, forbidden, and sealed. I might All right. Language, but I know a dictionary when I see one. Okay. Let's go. Quick save. <clears throat> Keep in base. It was so obvious this was gonna happen. Why did you go over there? Why not just do this? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, investigate Kazdor's palace. Get past the ballroom door's magical seal. We found a dictionary for an ancient language. We should hold on to it. It may prove useful. And I'm guessing that Godi has the, the signet ring. First, I want to see this area. The dormitory wing. Green fern. I must be busy. Busy, busy, busy. Master might see me. Master might approve. Okay. Spawn dormitory. What was that? Saved, frightened. Violet's diary. <clears throat> Are there wolves here? Blood donors. Hee <laughs> hee! The garlic in Houston's bed gave him a nasty rash. Serves him right for being such a whining runt. Now, if only I could get at that snob Leon and his brat of a daughter, but she's protected. Casador must have a fine plan for little Vict Vittoria. I wonder what it is. And blood donors. Casador's finest. When you're on the hunt, take prey by preference from the city's lower classes. Patriarchs may smell better, but it will attract unwanted attention if too many aristocrats vanish when they're out slumming. In the last month, you already brought in a Dlusker, a Jasso, and an Uathun. And now three wealthy families are up in arms. Watch it. Chamberlain Dufay. Okay. I'm thinking that she whatever it takes. still has the Afraid of Wolves or not. Yeah, Fear of Wolves. 
Where are my media? Alpha, make them So that's revealing something. Heading out. Maybe they're they're beneath us. <clears throat> is what I'm guessing here. And I'm over encumbered, so sent the camp. Everything must be perfect. Let's see here. Favorite spawn. Master not Yeah, these just sound like um like werewolves. Okay, is this relevant? Favorite spawn, Cazador's best prey hunters and who are entitled to stay in the special bedchamber year to date. Leon, Leon, Violet, Leon, Leon, Leon. Okay. So this Leon is gonna play, play a part here. For sure. Too many references already. Yeah, yeah, I know there are wolves underneath. Chill. So we go here. How are we in terms of spells? We are perfectly fine. This is Goldie. He's ambushing. He's weak to block. Okay, because he's a skeleton, of course. He's silent. I don't want to attack him. I'm going to speak with him. It will start combat anyway if this is an ambush. Spotted me, did you? Sharp for a mortal servant. <clears throat> Wait. You are neither okay. spawn nor servant. An intrusive mortal, then. You made a mistake, little thief. Uh, I'm pretty sure that he's not alone. Twenty AC, really? Repost. This is melee only. Okay, so if I want to knock him back, this would be the best way to do it. <laughs> Is he gonna call the hounds or something? Nope. You suck. You suck twice. You suck thrice. This reminds me I want to do something here before I forget, which is I want to go into my reactions on everyone and I actually want to make opportunity attack be something that is asked because the problem with having an automatic opportunity attacks is that if you spend your reaction using this, that means you can't use projected ward or a counter spell or any other ability you may have so I prefer it if the game asks instead of just using it okay so I would like to detect hidden creatures but it actually seems like he's alone doesn't it very strange key to the kennel czar family ring this ring carries a symbol of the Tsar family and has an inscription in some crusty old language. There's glyphs inscribed on the ring. Just like the ones in that book. I knew it. Don't scare me. Never onward. So where are the wolves? They are nine meters. I don't get it. Make Maybe they're here. on the other side. Okay, let's just ignore it, I suppose, and let's go up. <clears throat> uh, where is the way up? We have to go through here. 
and then we go through yeah we go through here this is the kennel that has nothing else that was the death room now we should be able to open the doors yeah over here let's see what's up Give me the quick save. The door is covered in intricate text, but you can't see anywhere it's a, bunch a key of rats. might fit. Only a small round hollow engraved with a family crest. That's clearly for Looking the ring. Closer, you recognize the writing. It's the same Kozakuran script from the dictionary you found. Press the SAR signet ring against the hollow and read the door's inscription aloud. The ring slots perfectly into place, and the door swings open. I will say, uh, I think this initial section of the of the area could have been done a lot better. This entire fight with uh, Godi or whatever his name was, just very, very basic, very simple. Make them okay, here they are. A bunch of wolves, bats and whatnot. Okay, let's see what they want from us. Sup, bitches? You can't be here. No one in, no one out. But most important, no witnesses. Mm hmm. Okay, good. I did want to fight, so thank you for that. We have a bunch of rats. We have so three werewolves, four bats, five rats, and two wolves. What is special about werewolves? Multi-attack wounded. Can it multi-attack if the target is prone or if its hit points are at 60% or less? So just a very, very basic enemy. Man, if I had fireball right now. <laughs> and what are they? They are humanoids. Okay. I did not actually expect werewolves to be humanoids. I was thinking something more along the lines of a monstrosity or something. Okay. These wolves are going to come for Will. Do I really care? Not really. What if I animate that? It's only his level 3 spell. Not very impressive. I could just use this. And then get away. Sure. Man, the effects are, are very, very cool. I'm gonna head back so that they don't break my... My concentration. Here, Wolfie, Wolfie, Wolfie. What is that? Savage Howl. Dashing. Dashing, yes. The character's movement speed is increased by 5 meters and gains 20 temporary hit points. Yes. Ready. All very impressive, my friends. All very impressive. You just decided to become an enemy right now. I couldn't care less about you. <clears throat> I think I will just go for a divine guardians here and i guess lazel can just kill these people what is the other one over there it's kind of far this is your end. don't care about you i'm not even gonna bother trying to knock them out i'll just kill them these are vampires anyway so on the move it really doesn't matter. Do I want to pew pew these people? Sure. Pew pew. Jesus. Whee! I'm ready. Okay. <clears throat> we shall go over here. Have to keep going. 
I actually forgot about the, the Frightened, but we we saved against it. Let's go for Radiance as a level 4. That is good enough. Let's hope they cannot break the concentration. Quick, quick, quick. Nice jump, man. Nice jump. Uh, short. Ah, uh, unfortunate. Really, he jumped into the. <laughs> no comment. He jumped into the spirit guardians. Okay, we have some friends over here, like werewolf, werewolf, rat, rat, bat. Just fireball everything. I can upcast it once. Yep. Cool. Back up. With ease. Okay, do your worst. This guy barely took the... Really? Okay. I thought he was gonna go into the... <clears throat> Wait, what? Oh, they don't just have a one hit point. Ow. Come on, concentrate, woman. Concentrate. Yes. Dude, they're all just dashing on top of her. Okay. I would just like to go here and push this guy over there. I think it'll be funny. Um, yeah, I'll just go for more lightning damage. Ah, it was because of the, sh the Savage Howl. Right. Okay, I think I'm just gonna kill all of these vermin. Not gonna bother with werewolves just yet. Like this. Thank God. I thought I hit. I thought I hit Shadow Heart. But I didn't. Good. Uh, let's defend this one. Again with that. It's fine. Not very smart. Not very smart at all. So, you are burning these people. Let's try to burn this guy as well. Oh, come on. I can't... Okay, I can't move any further or they will attack me. Time to strike. Let's go over here. Okay. 90% even with all in. Awesome. I can actually try the maneuver to make her move without triggering attack opportunity, right? Uh, increasing their movement speed. And they don't provoke attack opportunity. Nice, okay. So, maneuvering attack. Wait. Huh? Ah, okay. You can use force maneuver. Okay, so I can do this on her. And now she can move freely. I can also just kill this guy. Okay. Let's end this. So now she can do like this. And let's go back into the wolvies. Actually, let's just stay here, I suppose. And what do we want to do with her? Not much. Just just a cantrip is fine. Okay, perfect. You have to end your turn. And we are gonna go for the chain lightning. Because why not, my friends? Why not? 
Perfection? Damn! Okay. Come on, rat. Wait, he didn't get burned? How? Okay, now he got burned. Um. Pew pew pew. Okay. Fights are just getting very, very easy. Maybe this is famous last words and then I get ambushed by something and just die. <laughs> okay, so... Um... Uh, shit music. Sheet music for General Sandro's death suite, a funerary celebration in three parts. Ah, there's a way over there. San Severina. I'll get you in. Sanzi, I've been invited to play at a party at the Sar Palace tonight in their ballroom. Show the Chamberlain at the door this note and he'll let you in to join me. Wear your best dress, Kalira. Yeah. Was not worth it, was it? They had nothing. This is a door, but is this a secret, a secret door? Hmm. hmm. Office hall. Where am I? A dice. Probably takes me up or down. I do feel like I want to have a full rest now Because I will want uh, spells on will Party planner This seems to be the working notebook used by a certain Chamberlain Dufay to plan Casador's gatherings in the mansion ballroom Functions are divided into two categories Those for invited guests are those for involuntary guests uh, Oh sorry, and those for involuntary guests The entertainment for the latter category being considerably more sinister than the former the final handwritten entry is below. Master has ordered a special party, a final feast, he said. This will be my ultimate test, but I am prepared. And I'm sure the guests, both invited and involuntary, will be thrilled to participate. Yeah, sure. And that's all. Okay, so there is this dice, but there's also this area here. Oh, it's a... S hmm. It might end up being a larger area. Okay. Let's just take care of this right now. Oh, this is a danger zone. Oh, okay. Okay, shell. There's a button. Maybe it opens the other door? can hide over there and we explore this area over here is open mouth shut oh, enough waiting i crave blood cool. one true way kalira ballroom invitation lutenist kalira you have been recommended to the sar mansion as a musician of both talent and discretion and we have need of both consider yourself hired to play at a fete in the mansion ballroom on the first evening on the next 10 day Dress is reserved rather than ostentatious. Chamberlain Dufay. P.S. Be prepared to play requests. <clears throat> okay. Weave moss. A blood bank. Scroll of eye bite. Counting house safe number one key. Interesting. I wonder if there are keys for all of the safes. Although, I'm not sure if these ones I've already opened. I do not know. Regardless, let us continue. 
I'm hoping that maybe if I go up here, I'll be allowed to have a full rest. If not, I might just, you know, go back out, have a full rest, and then continue on. Ah, this is a safe area. Alturiac 1477. Until I was 13 years of age, I didn't know that Uncle Casador was a vampire. That, indeed, my entire family were vampires going back generations. Growing up on the Tsar country estate near Ungavled, raised by old family servants, I rarely visited our city palace in Baldur's Gate. And when I did, I couldn't wait to leave and return to the country. The city palace, straddling the wall between the upper and lower city, was more than creepy. It was somehow chilling. Amanita Tsar. And... The butler's cane has a knob on the end. This comedy of errors centers around the butler, Vincent Raspington, who, thought, who though he is a silly dragonborn with stiff manners and a generally baffled attitude to the goings on of a fire, fair ladies and their gentlemen ends up going arse over tea kettle into extremely erotic situations with the local nobility. What? Needless to say, he's unprepared for it. There's a particularly good sequence in which Vincent, a seven-foot-tall dragonborn, must pretend to be a shy little gnome named Missy Whipples Wimple Snatch during a banquet. Guffaw, fnar, hee hee, ahum, etc. What the goddamn. Okay, so while I am in a safe area, I'm guessing this button opens this door. We are going to have a full rest. And then continue exploring. Why am I. Why am I in my, in my underwear? <laughs> Very cute underwear as well. <laughs> um, what is my clothes? Uh, clothes. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's rest. It worked this time. Awesome. Nobody wanted to speak to me. I'm amazed. Not even a Sterian. Okay. Okay. Uh, usual buffing routine. Defender of the people. I feel like I'm missing something. I, I am missing something. I want my lightning thing what did this one do before i forget when you deal spell damage inflict one turn of reverberation upon the target penalty to strength dexterity and constitution per remaining turn when it has four or more it takes thunder damage and possibly falls prone i don't think it really matters all that much yeah let's just go for uh lightning Perfect. And you as well. Okay. Let's carry on. Looked like it, would, it was glowing. Best foot forward. Where am I? Don't scare me. Tarsac 1477. On my 13th birthday, I was summoned to the city palace by Uncle Casador. Old Drossel hitched the team to the best carriage and drove me to Baldur's Ra Black Dragon Gate, where I was met by porters and a litter to carry me through the upper city to Sar Palace. The Chamberlain was waiting to conduct me to the ballroom, a chamber mysterious to me, as I'd never been allowed to enter it before. Amanita Zar again. Okay. I'm guessing she's a vampire now, based on all of the... All of her notes in caskets. Yeah, I know I missed two gold there. I'm not gonna care. <laughs> I'm in some kind of attic. A rusty hand axe. Another button. Garlic. Is this the first time I've I've seen garlic in the game? It might be. Or maybe I'm just crazy. A prison with garlic. 
I'm encumbered because of a necklace. Awesome. Um, split in half. Sin to Lazel. Split in half. Sin to Lazel. Let's see. A button behind some boxes. This just keeps going up and up. <clears throat> Solemnly outfit in gold medallions. No, don't speak Almost with her. Traveling with company. <clears throat> this is <clears throat> an alternative dress. I guess I can use this one. Instead of this one. Just to look a little bit more regal. Hmm. Okay, I have to check the crates, man. Otherwise, I'll go crazy. Why am I not surprised? Just keep going up. A wooden chest. It's all very weird, this is Arrow of lightning. A pouch that contains a silver key and a flute. That's it? The entire reason for coming up here is to pick up a key. Um, okay. So I... Oh, oh, no, no, no. This is new. This is a door, obviously. Okay. Another one of these. Uncle Cazador made me a vampire, but I refused to participate in the family rites. He gave me the hunger, but he could not break my will. He had Blovart imprison me in the attic. I weakened. They sent up human blood and eventually I drank it. For a year they stopped sending anything. I tore at the walls in frustration, then they sent up a bound captive. Yeah. And that's how she got turned. All right. I wonder if you can fight her and she's like, oh. And she's like a boss. Wait, wait, wait. Flame rule. I succumbed. I am a vampire and damned. I curse the name of Zar and reject it. Now I stay in the attic by choice and write my little histories. I am Lady Incognita. Amanita is no more. Hmm. Key to Cazador's dungeon. Really? That's all? This is very little... Very little treasure, my friend. Okay, this just closes the door. Hmm. Does another door open if I do this? Okay, uh, wait. Did I... I, I came from there? I can't see a goddamn thing. There's nothing over there. We've been up there. There's nothing over there. I can't get there. Why? Oh, because this is locked again. Wait, what? Uh. Game. Game. I pressed it again, it, it worked. I'm not even gonna bother. <clears throat> I am not even gonna bother trying to understand it. We are quite simply leaving. I didn't see the girl though. I was curious about it. Lady Incognita. Seemed interesting, but nowhere to be found, it seems. We did pick up the key to the dungeon, which I don't know where it is. We've cleared this area, we've cleared that area. So where am I supposed to go from here? That is what I do not know. No, I came from there. I think.
It's Rampart door. Uh, I feel like I'm missing something, clearly. Yeah, this is the outside. Um, okay, I missed the door. Is it here? No, this is just a, a window. <sighs> what did I miss? Not you. I've been... This is the can... It, weird kennels, but okay. Yeah, I came here. I found this guy. This is the dormitory wing. No other doors available. And the same thing over here. Okay, I'm getting the feeling that I missed something in the... In the... Oh no! No, I, I remember. Okay. I remember. I'm dumb. The thingy, the dice. Where is the dice? I forgot. Of course I forgot. Of course I forgot. Is it here? No. This is the hidden room. No. Werewolves. Okay, it, it has to be down there. Sorry about this. I'm gonna reach a dice and that's what we're gonna call the episode, I think. I just need to find it. It's not here. Yep, not here. Not here. It seems like it should be right there. It's not here. God damn it. Am I making a fool of myself? I surely am. <sighs> okay. It has to be this thing. Going up again. <laughs> How did I miss it? Not here. It should be there. There! Okay, there. How do we even go there? Ah, this door. Okay, I had forgotten. I, I had completely forgotten. Okay, <clears throat> so. We found the dice, thank god. We are all with a long rest upon us, so we are all very... All, um... Well and good with our spells and whatnot. So in the next episode we're gonna explore the dice, hopefully find this Casador guy and murder all of the vampires. As always, my friends, I hope you guys are having fun here with me in the channel watching some Baldur's Gate 3. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave a comment below. If you enjoy the content, consider subscribing for more, many more videos coming out soon, and I hope to see you all in the next episode. Until then, stay safe everyone.